Okay, welcome back to turn 47 of Heavy Hitters. Now, uh, we are sort of back to the old uh, tactical waiting again. Uh, Titan did push a platoon. <laughs> Look, you can see them sleeping there. Um, over here, and we managed to pretty much you know, wipe it out. That's not a combat effective little bunch of pixel tripping there. Um, and that was definitely an infantry platoon. Uh, three rifle squads and the HQ that we spotted. Um, and that's a big deal because I don't know where Titan's infantry actually is. I have a feeling there's at least a platoon's worth got pushed out when he uh, pushed them over here and uh, we didn't, we weren't in a position to, to deal with them. And they might be kind of conglomerating in that, uh, that wood. But uh, as we keep saying, all the stuff out here is HQ units, armor, and uh, heavy weapons teams, mortars and MGs. So uh, it could be that Titan is planning to dislocate all of my positions uh, by fire. That is, um, planning to just shoot up the buildings until I run away and then move in and occupy it. But... Um, yeah, I really don't know. Or maybe I'm just reading it wrong and he's going to start storming buildings uh, with uh, guys carting MG42s around on tripods. What do I know? In other news, in the last turn, uh, we've caught sight of the Panzer IV again. And it may be running up that way. Uh, Titan definitely knows uh, that this Greyhound is hanging around on the flank. Uh, he might also be feeling that there's some armour over here if he hasn't clocked the um the sherman there or maybe he's just gonna put the panzer four back and try and face off against the sherman i'm not sure he's definitely moving his heavy armor up on this flank uh, but if the panzer four carries on on its current trajectory where it's going here it should hopefully get spotted by the hellcat and engaged in the back which would be nice the greyhound is legging it away it doesn't need to be there right now um and yeah Essentially, uh, oh yeah, the other the other thing that happened is Titan had pushed up uh, some scouts to try and check this house out, and they were uh, ambushed uh, by the guys in the building who are now being, well, very likely to be uh, mangled by whatever support fire Titan is going to direct on the building. Uh, but I don't know whether he's going to try and push anything out to try and attack it. Don't know. Uh, yeah, lots of don't knows. Let's try and resolve it a little bit. And of course we've got mortar fire landing on these guys here too. Yep. Holes in that building. That's entirely expected. Yeah, that's the King Tiger shooting up that uh, that building there. That's fine. Kind of completely expect that. The Panzer IV is going that way. The MG Jeep there is getting rinsed, but that's entirely expected. Uh, someone is relentlessly trying to machine gun the uh, the tank commander or infantry around the King Tiger by the looks of it. That's all those hits coming off it. And it looks like Titan's pushing some troops up here. That's cool. Yeah, not sure what he's doing with the Panzer IV, but it's definitely not going up that way. Um, yeah, so let's have a, a check what happened to these guys. Uh, what happens is the King Tiger just starts opening up on the building. Not at all surprising. What we really want here is these this guy to get killed. This is really annoying. He's actually trading fire with them. Um, so look, so the guy who stayed in the building is dead, and these two guys have legged it out the back. Um, 
yeah. That's not tremendously surprising. Let's see. Um, yeah, I have no idea what that Panzer IV was doing. I said this side of the dude here. So it was going that way. It's now turning around and coming back in here. Well, that's interesting. I wonder what happens if... Yeah. I really want to kill off this... Um, this guy here. Who is, you know, being engaged by lots of stuff, but it seems to be relentlessly invincible. Uh, this is because I want him to go away. I mean, I don't think he can see the uh, the Hellcat, but... I uh, probably definitely can't see the Hellcat, but, you know, I want him to... Um... Uh, go so Titan doesn't have any eyes on it, basically. And, oh, what we're getting with these guys? These guys, yeah, we kicked this the last time. And they are kind of suppressed. Yeah. yeah. So there's another MG team over here somewhere, which is shooting them up. Check the jeep. I think it's that panther pushing forward. Yeah. Which incredibly. Oh yes, they can actually see it. Yeah, that's not surprising at all. Uh, it was going to get hoovered up at some point, uh, but let's just check. We did get some mortar fire landing here last turn, so. See if we get any of these guys. Doesn't like it. Oh, 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 actually, yeah. See, that's another HQ unit with a single person in it. bits of stuff over here. Well, that we can see, I should add. Those guys are kind of like routinely getting suppressed. What is, actually, I need to check what the uh, MG is shooting at, because... Ah, it's shooting at these guys, that's cool. That's why they're suppressed then. It's just occasionally pinging off the front of the uh, King Tiger. That's cool. And then, um, like he was moving something up here at the end of the turn. These guys, who are probably... Yeah, that's an infantry squad. Yep, there we all, there we all are. Interesting place for them to go. <laughs> to be completely honest. All these guys in the church can you know can see them, but I'm again like we did with the uh the guys in the house here, we're not gonna bother engaging because uh, you know, un until we get to like point blank range, because uh, there's just no mileage in it. And I think that's about all there is to see there. Let's just give it a bit of a. Yeah, we've got a half track. That's full of infantry as well. And it's not 100% clear what Titan's doing with that. 
all the tanks are pushed up this way, so maybe we can, um, if we push up, we can get some hits on that with the, uh, with the Greyhound. Uh, but let's let's say here that Titan comes up here over the next few turns and he uh, you know, manages to take the church, which is not an outrageous uh, proposition. Uh, then his troops in the church are going to be exposed to all the stuff down here and we can just like smack them around. And like I'm saying, it might not be affecting Titan's calculus of uh, how this is all fitting together. But I remain pretty sure that um, uh, he's, if not low on infantry, then he uh, isn't willing to commit it to high casualties. Um, definitely been smacking his infantry around here in the sunken lane, and um, you know we wiped a platoon out there. These guys we're going to be able to roughly handle these guys as well when it comes down to it. So. Yeah. Right. So, first thing I think we have to do is uh, we can't quite. I want to kill this guy because that's going to give me a bit of freedom. Uh, and a Sherman should be completely safe there. He says. Yeah, that should do the trick for seventy five mil shells. the smoke from the half track so yeah we actually have to come quite a way forward with that. Uh, so it might be better to actually go back and ooh, I don't know set up here yeah let's do that uh, these guys are not having a fun time. That, that doesn't mean the war's over for them. Just wondering if these guys here are also a A um, what do you call them? Infantry squad. I think these guys are actually engaged in a like MG duel. Uh, with the 42s. The question of whether to move them is actually kind of important. He says, ignoring it. See, that's like a... Oh, that was a HMG team, wasn't it? There's a lot of dead people down here. What's a dead pixel trap? Remains a pity that it can't shoot out this way. Uh, this mortar too. Uh, 
Uh, but all I'm thinking here is with this uh, jeep out of the way, Titan's gonna push it. He's sending a scout up to have a look. Uh, I feel like he's gonna try and push some infantry this way if he has it. So let's put some fire down on the little crossroads uh, with that mortar team. That's what I'm thinking there anyway. Where's that infantry? I'm trying to think if I can get a bead on that infantry anywhere without overly exposing uh, the HQ Greyhound. Hello. Could bum rush it down here. Where it's relatively safe, but no. Um, Well, yeah, I was going to say no get out, but we've got a big reverse slope to play with. Uh, and if we can set it up... Uh, yeah, in defilade behind the church, and then we've also got the reverse slope to run away on. Uh, that could actually be a really good spot for the Greyhound. Where is it? There it is. slope, hold down, that will do, that will do nicely. Uh, they'll actually, let's bring it back this way a bit, uh, thinking about where that uh, Panzer IV is. So I need to think about whether that panther over there is going to move. Uh, but if we get up here with the, the church in between, and oh yeah, we can shoot all the way out there, and let's, uh, yeah, we should be screened off from the Panzer IV there. Come on, I just, honestly, I'm basically doing this because I want to see some canister. Uh, Pappas' favourite type of ammunition. Um, yeah, it looks like we're, we're starting to get into a good position to start a chewing titan up. Uh, which is what we really want here. Uh, yeah, let's go have a look at the attack. Okay, welcome back to turn 47 for the attack for heavy hitters. Now, I honestly can't remember very much about what's going to happen here. Um, so I'm pretty much just going to end up pressing go. What I think is going to be going on is we're going to try and take this position out here. Uh, we're definitely moving the flak, the surviving, I should add, flak truck round uh, to get eyes on that house and try and just blow it up. Um, uh, in the meantime, we're just trying to get some extra bodies into the church. Uh, we spotted the Hellcat again, which is down here by these two shell marks and these half tracks here with the ammo for the 81 millimeter mortar and its single rather upset operator uh, should hopefully start plopping rounds in there in a little bit uh, not a lot going on on this flank i don't think uh, and we'll give these guys a bit of a rest and then start plodding them down here so we can kind of get a bit of a security screen out here so we don't get any nasty surprises again 
Uh, this half track is retreating, this one is shooting everything, seeing as this one is practically out of ammunition, was it? I can't remember. Hmm, whatever. Um, as a standby to feeding more troops into that uh, fight at the front of the village here, so we're just going to press go here. And uh, all we're expecting is just a load of machine gun fire down in the village, basically. Or the edge of the village, rather. Ah, yes, the other thing was, it was this 81mm mortar team popped up again in the last... Um, in the last turn. Um, we should hopefully be putting some area fire down on that. That's the uh, location of that. Sounds like it might be dropping some rounds in. There's the Hellcat again. Spotted by the guys in the church tower. And, ooh, we're spotting quite a lot of stuff from that position over there. This is one of the reasons why I want the church tower. Uh, because it's going to basically feed me intel. Yeah, it looks like the uh, mortar has managed to get a round off. That's excellent. Let's just see what we've got here because we've spotted it. This was, should be a sniper. Yeah, scoped little uh, Springfield there. This is should be a mortar team. Yep, yeah, 60 mm mortar. And then we've got the Hellcat. Uh, I'm just checking to see where that round fell. Ah, it was there. Okay. Yeah, a bit of an overshoot, but that's fine. And, oh, hello. You're out in the open. Why are you out in the open? Yeah, let's have a look at what we've got up here. Interesting to see if these guys are uh, people who've run out of these, or Titans, Americans that have run out of some of these houses uh, that we've now spotted from the guys on the flank. Oh hey, having some kind of recon screen up in front is really smart, isn't it? Um, or whether uh, they're from earlier. I don't know, it looks like it's those guys legging it. Garen's running off there. Consistent plinking on this uh, that half track. I think there's very much else that we can really see, or that we're going to see here. Yeah. Okay, so the uh, the mortar is doing its thing. Uh, it's about time we got lucky and landed a shell in something. We did it with the Hummel, actually, didn't we, earlier in the attack? But... It managed to not destroy it, which is kind of disgusting. And those guys are moving up there. Uh, these half tracks. Hmm. I'm not sure what that half track's doing actually. Ah, that one's going back because it has no ammo. Got it. Not ammo, it's got loads of ammo, uh, because it's got no driver. And yeah, we were going to pick up uh, this infantry platoon. And we can just feed them across one at a time. Um, 
because, you know, if Titan does have stuff around here uh, that we haven't spotted, more AT guns, more stuff like that, um, seeing just the one, uh, you know, seeing one, uh, one half track, that's not worth exposing the position for. Uh, but seeing, say, four half tracks, yeah, I would totally open fire and reveal my position for four half tracks. So, these guys are kind of managing. He's got two thousand rounds of ammo. He's carting around. He can suppress the snipe out of them. Yeah. So, like I said, it's kind of, yeah, it is slow and steady. Um, but without, um, without the kind of nasty surprise uh, over here, all this burning stuff, which was entirely my fault. Um, and like I've said, it would have been so easy to just put a scout team here and uh, not have to worry about all these problems but hey ho that's not happened um, uh, we got spanked for that uh, we wouldn't actually be that uh, too far down on casualties I've almost certainly lost fewer men than Titan has in his attack whether we've lost similar amounts of combat power, which is what counts, seeing as though I've lost a big chunk of my armor, two slugs and a panther and a flak wagon, uh, compared to Titan, who has lost a Hummel and a half track in the vehicles uh, department. Mm. Yeah. Uh, but uh, it's early days yet, and we will see one thing I'm doing that Titan isn't doing yet is denying this objective uh, which probably won't make that much difference but hey ho yeah, let's keep that shooting and the panther we don't need to worry too much about the panther shooting Some fire on those guys. That was the. Um, there was an 81 mil mortar there at one point, wasn't there? And let's just do a very quick final. Uh, is there any? Are there any holes in the walls and things again that may or may not be Jackson's? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, let's press go on that front. Uh, very slowly getting there. 